Hi friends, in this video I will tell you how to download NDSI images in ArcGIS. First, we will download the Landsat 8 R7 level 1 images. To download the images, we go to Earth Explorer usgs.gov you can make a free account here to download the images now zoom in into your area of interest my area of interest is the hks region so now Go to Polygon and use map like this. Use map. You can see that all the area is red and this image is selected. Now you can drag it anywhere. Cloud cover. So choose 0 to 10% it should be less than 10% data range so select a month suppose I select uh, uh, 7 2008 20, 21. Okay. Now click data set and land set. Since we are going to download level 1 images, so click here level 1 and land set level a uh, lens at 8 level 1 images so click here and select additional criteria land cloud to cloud cover so it should be 0 to 10 percent so should, we should have an area free of clouds now results go to results And wait for a minute now you can see that there are several images uh, shown here and uh, if you click on this option you can see that this area will be covered in this uh, image so now deselect it and I click here this is not our area of interest this is also not our area of interest this is also outside our area of interest so you check one by one and the one which is your area of interest select that one next So this is our area of interest, it is in the middle. So now choose this download option. And you can see that there are various images. So uh, I will, uh, you can see that there are different bands, uh, band 10, band 11, band 1, 2, 3. Uh, so I want to download this as a bulk so I will click here since I have already downloaded these images so uh, after downloading this um, I directly go to my files so these are the images which I have downloaded now since we know that we have to identify the uh, NDSI images and the formula for NDSI image land set 8 is band 3 minus band 6 divided by band 3 
plus band 6. So in these files we have band 3 images which is in the TIFF file and band 6 images. So what I should I will go to the ArcGIS <coughs> since I have opened a new file. So I will set the units, go to layer properties and I select WGS 1984, apply and OK. Now you can see here that the units are set. Now select the images we are required with band 3 and band 6 images. So select these two images and go to RGIS and drag it here. <clears throat> wait for the images now you can see that the images are on the screen okay now what should we do in the next step we are going to identify our NDSI values so go to arc toolbox <clears throat> and go to special analyst tool here select map algebra and raster calculator double click on raster calculator <clears throat> now we will apply the formula so to apply the formula go to uh, in the right side window, double click on the float and band 3 which is green band, band 3, double click on band 3 minus band 6 and then divide by again cl double click on the float band 3 plus band 6 and output raster uh, is a default so I press the OK key now wait uh, a minute to process now you can see that the images uh, the raster calculator image is being processed and you can see uh, the NDSI image. Now, go to the properties. And classify. And we select two classes classify and we select point 4 ok now apply now you can see that the white areas which is shown here uh, denotes the snow while the black area shows the other area so this is the classification of uh, NDSI images I hope you have understood uh, this topic if you have any questions then uh, you can ask in the comment box thank you very much for watching